Hey, so I just finished uh, this uh, character and before I bring him into Substance Painter for uh, texturing, I would like to create a quick uh, turntable just so I can uh, take a look and have them have him uh, spin um, in front of me. So what I would like to do is I'm going to select my character, go to my uh, animation drop down, then go to visualize, then click on create turntable and it's set to 300 um, frames and clockwise. So I'm just going to simply say turntable. Then I'm going to come down here, set it to 300, and then drag my time slider to include all 300 frames. And now if I just simply press play, my character will automatically spin as a turntable. And if you wanted to see uh, your outliner, you can see that a group has been created and in that group you have a turntable camera and if you want to uh, jump out of this or you can actually right click on your camera and you can see right here it says turntable ta camera one or perspective so for example I can go back to perspective mode I can move around do whatever I want and then if I wanted to jump back into my turntable I just simply right click and go to turntable camera and now as you can see I'm back in my in my camera view now one thing that you'll realize is that as the character spins he kind of slows down um, in the beginning and the end so let's take a look and see what the graph editor looks uh, like for um, for our animation so what I'm gonna do is go to uh, Windows animation editor and then click on graph editor now if we select our group we can see the animation curve for our camera so if we didn't want to have that ease in and out we can just select both of these points and just simply click on this button here linear tangents you can see that our line became straight and now if we close our graph editor and press play our animation will not be easing in and out during the rotation so that's how easy it is to create a turntable in Maya. And now if we wanted to flip this, and maybe we wanted to spin uh, the other way, maybe we, we can select our um, keyframe on 300, hold down the shift key and just simply click, and then you will be able to kind of drag this around. Let's drag this, uh, let's leave it right in front for a minute, and then grab this guy by holding down the shift key and just drag this keyframe frame all the way to 300 and now again hold on the shift and just move it back and now if we press play you'll see that the character will actually spin the other way because we just simply flipped the two keyframes which reverses the um, curve and reverses our animation so i hope you found this uh, useful i'll see you next video